Are you bored on a summer day? Well, I got something for you. Today, we're gonna be making a paper flute. Okay, so, are you ready to do it? Here's a list of tools that you will need. Bam, paper. Boom, hole puncher. Boom, tape. Doesn't matter what kind of tape, but you better have some tape. And finally, bam, oh wait, bam, an X-Acto knife. If you don't have all four of these supplies ready in hand, you've already failed. Okay, so first of all, we get the paper. You roll the paper. See that? Roll the paper nice and tight. And you may think, we got a flute now. Yeah, look at that, it's over. No, it's not. It's not over at all. So, now. Bada boom, we get the hole puncher. Go ahead and just stuff it in there. Hold on. Now it's in there. Boom! Look at that. Hole punched. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Uh huh. Up. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Hole punch is acquired. Go ahead and straighten it out a little bit. Because you did flatten it a little bit. I bet you did. So, now we go ahead. We got our flute. Think we're done now? No, we're not. Boom, we get tape. Pull this hole puncher back. some of this tape right here. Stick it like that. Make sure to roll it up. And then just have at it with the tape, dude. Just go ahead and all around if you want to. Now what I'm doing is I'm showing you a rookie mistake. I'm not, I'm doing this on purpose, don't worry. I'm not a rookie, so I'm, I'm doing, I'm doing what I'm doing right. So what you did is, if you are a rookie, I bet you are, you went and covered up one of the holes. Not something you shouldn't do. So what do you do? You get the hole puncher, no, we don't get the hole puncher. This is where the knife comes in. So what you do is you just go ahead and just stab that in there. You create that hole yourself. I mean, it's hard to do it with paper. But I got it. See? Or if you lucked out like me, you just go in the middle. Look at that. Look. Look. Look at the hole now. It's a beautiful hole. Yeah, it's an awesome hole. You can't see it, look at the awesome hole. Look at this, that's beauty, okay? Then we go get our other holes, like this one right here. This one, we're going to cut out into a V. That way, it can be our mouthpiece. Now, you don't have to have it here, you can just tear it off. I wouldn't recommend it though, for beginners. So, you guys are gonna have to do it normally. See, look at that. V shape. V shape immediately. Boom. Now, get your exacto knife. Go for the bottom hole. Okay? See, the bottom hole is not lined up. Doesn't matter. Go ahead and just dig another hole. Look at that. Look. Look at how that looks. That's a beautiful hole, man. So now we got a flute. You see that? This is what your flute should look like. If your flute does not look like this, then you failed, okay? It better not look like any other thing. It better not look like it. It better look exactly like this. 
you fail if you didn't do this, okay? Good. Now, if you've done this, you are a great person to do stuff like this. Okay, so toss that there, and we're gonna clean up now. So what you do is you come up here, pick up the exact one, put the top back on it. You shouldn't need instructions for this, you should know how to clean. If you need instructions for this, something's wrong. All right, so now that you have your flute ready, if you give it a time to set, let it sit about 30 minutes in the hot sun. That way it kind of melts. So, I've already sat mine in the sun for 30 minutes, so come back later, pause the video right now, and come back later. But if you've already done that, you're an expert, just like me. So, if you've played any kind of flute before, you know that this is the most difficult flute to, fl to play. So, I'm gonna show you how to play it right now. What you're gonna do is gonna put two fingers here, like this, and you're gonna put all your grip on here. And then, as soon as you have that, what you gotta do is you gotta do like this. This way, not this way, this way. And once you get it like that, you should be able to play something like this. Hey guys, it's your music maestro here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video of my musical bliss. And if you want, and I mean if you want, go ahead and click that subscribe button. That way you can see more of my musical bliss. Don't forget to buy my album. You can buy it on iTunes, Apple Music, even GoFundMe. It doesn't matter. Link will be in the description. Thanks for watching. Oh, and yes, that is me playing.